Welcome to the Family Review Show. Today, we're reviewing the top Roblox tower defense games and figuring out which one is the best. All right, look, we're going to start right here with Tower Defense Simulator. You can see right now playing 17.5 thousand people. Hop in. Let's show everybody what Tower Defense is if they don't know already. All right, Luke, so this is Tower Defense Simulator. Talk to me about some of the things you really like about Tower Defense Simulator or TDS. So Tower Defense Simulator has amazing graphics, and it's one of the most OG Roblox games on the platform. It, it's just such a classic, and they're constantly updating it like every other week. That's one of the things I like about TDS is all the different events they've had. Now, you know, we've reviewed this game a lot. We've done live streams for Tower Defense Simulator. Um, one of the things that I like about this is sort of like the military style of the different troops, right? You understand what I'm saying? There's like, you got like the helicopters. You've got flamethrower guys, right? You've yeah. got machine guns. Um, you've got like the tanks and the tank factory and all that stuff. So, um, yeah, this is a great game. As I said, it's 17.5 thousand people playing it right now. There's a reason it's one of the most popular tower defense games. Uh, let us know what you think in the comments below if this is one of your favorites. Anything you don't like about this game, Luke? Any like downside to it? Um, no, not really. Okay. Um, just it it can get um repetitive. Okay. Um. So that's why you think that's kind of like. The point of a tower defense game is the rounds. Yep. But and do you think that's why they add those events in to sort of like keep it, you know, fresh and adding new things and yeah. new troops and things like that? Yeah. All right. So this is tower defense. Uh, let's head to our next one. All right. Next up, Luke, we have all star tower defense. As you can see, there are right now 22.8 thousand people playing. Let's hop in and take a look at what this one is. Hey, now you're an all star. Get the game on. Go play. All right, Luke, so this is All-Star Tower Defense. Now, out of the ones we're going to review in this video, this is the one that we have played the least. So this one is sort of new to us. Uh, but as you saw from those numbers, this is a really popular game, always at the top of, like, the most played experiences. Uh, right away, you notice a lot of differences. Yeah. So unlike the military style of uh, Tower Defense Simulator, this one is obviously more anime style. And what, what are some of the things that you notice about this one, Luke? Uh, I know nothing about any of this stuff. So Luke doesn't know much about anime, uh, but I notice that there's different anime characters in there. There's uh, like, there is, uh, Goku, but Koku. Yeah, so they're not like the actual ones because of obvious like licensing and stuff. Um, and there's like Naruto um, and all different sorts of anime characters. I wonder what his name is. Zaruto. Zaruto. Okay, so, uh, but I kind of like that because obviously anime is really popular. Uh, people love, like, you know, watching the shows, reading the uh, graphic novels and all that stuff. So I could see why this would be so popular right now. Gameplay, see, obviously very similar in the tower defense sort of uh, style. But I do like that you have the different characters, range and, you know, DPS and all that stuff. So this is that. This is that. I saw there's, like, daily rewards, uh, all different game uh, types. So that is uh, All-Star Tower Defense. Uh, let's head to the next one, Luke. All right, Luke, the next one that we're going to review is Tower Heroes. If you look up, you see this one has 1.5 thousand people playing. Let's hop in and check it out. All right, Luke, so this is Tower Heroes, a game we actually know quite well. We've done a lot of Tower Heroes videos and a lot of Tower Hero uh, live streams. Actually, some of our videos that we've done for Tower Heroes, people are still watching. I see that all the time. Uh, with some of our guides, how to get the different characters. But uh, talk about Tower Heroes to me, Luke. Okay, so this game is really, really fun. So, because they're constantly updating it and giving it new updates. Like, uh, for instance, the Halloween update gives you um, the candy corn, which allows you to get different things, like different uh, followers, different characters. Like, here I have lore. Um, and it's a really good and solid game. Um, Graphically, I like this one a lot. Yeah. Um, it looks really good. Um, I mean, it's colorful. They have characters that aren't quite as blocky as, like, Tower Defense. Um, you know, the first yeah. one. 
Uh, they're not quite cartoons like the second one, but they are um, all really interesting, right? So they have these characters that are all original. They're really fun. They all have their different powers. They're constantly adding new ones. Uh, and they all work interestingly together. So that's one of the things I think, and as you mentioned, they're constantly updating it. They do different events. They have other like features like stickers and you know the different skins for the characters. Th this is a really uh, sort of unique game in the tower defense genre for Roblox. Yes, it, it is. Uh, the other thing that I, I, I like is they seem very receptive to fan feedback and the other ones might as well i'm not as active in those communities so i don't know them as well but that is one thing about uh tower heroes that i do know is that the uh developers listen to a lot of the feedback so this is it this is tower heroes uh let's go and talk about the rest of them so as you can see there are so many different types of roblox tower defense games luke actually just hopped into another one what was this one luke SCP Tower Defense. SCP Tower Defense. It feels like there are different Tower Defense games that have themes for all different sorts of genres and things like that. And they all have their own unique little twists. Like this one has like what different SCP? And towers. Towers and like. And powers. Oh, powers. You get powers yeah, and things and like that. Um, so we want to know. We only really reviewed a few of them. There's so many out there. If we forgot one that you really love, let us know in the comments below. We'll go back and check out more of these. So let us know which of your favorites weren't featured in here. Uh, and Luke, let's wrap this thing up. So now we want to hear from you. Make sure you click that like button and let us know in the comments section which of these tower defense games you like the best. Or as I just said, if there's one that we didn't get to that you love, make sure you let us know about that in the comments section. But we'll follow this up. We want to know, like, you're voting here. Let us know what your favorite tower defense is because people are always asking what's the best Roblox tower defense. We need you to tell us what's the best one. We have our opinions, but we're not gonna tell you them in this video, right? We'll do a follow-up video with all of your comments and your opinions, and we'll let you know what everybody decided. Uh, so make sure you click that subscribe button, turn those notifications on so you never miss another one of our videos, and so you know when we have the follow-up, and let us know in the comments section what your favorite uh, your favorite tower defense game is. Luke, anything you wanna add before we get out of here? Uh no. All right. Uh, make sure you give this video a big thumbs up. And as always, we will see you next time. Bye. Bye.